Chiggy, check this out. We're a drink history. You got your boy Mop Top back. And honestly, I'm gonna introduce this drink because this is one of my favorite drinks in the world. It's probably one of the most classic cocktails. I will judge your bartending on this drink. I'm gonna make a prediction here. Yeah. Tell us about it, John, what's up? So we're doing the old fashioned, right? Super basic, super classic. Uh, invented in the 1800s, late 1800s at the Penn Dennis Club. Ooh, I didn't Colonel, know that. Colonel Pepper. Hey. Pepper something. So we're going to do a little bit of ice in our finishing glass. Make sure we're ready. I'm ready. A nice two ounce heavy handed pour. Always heavy handed on that old Kentucky bag. bourbon. The only thing that will do. A little bit of simple. Couple dashes Angostura. And then because this is all spirit, we're gonna stir this. It's pretty much an all alcohol drink, yeah? Yep. Typically one of the first drinks you really, you start ordering when you really start drinking. You know, if you're- What if are you trying dad, to say about me, man? If your grandpa- <laughs> I'm not getting out of this chair. Uh, had any influence on you. They probably had a couple of these around the house. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna strain. All right, I'm gonna tell you right now, our entire friendship has come down to this moment of this drink. We're gonna do a big old swath of orange. Yes. Nice flavor on that, all the way around. Get the inside too. Finish it with your classic cherry. Absolutely. And there you go, old fashioned. Let me, let me, let me check this out real quick. I gotta, I'll be the judge. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We can stay friends? We can stay friends. This is fire actually, this is really good. I was just saying, you know, my good friend Marcus over at Talon Bar makes one of the best ones I've heard. You could compete, I'm not too sure. We'll have to do a head-to-head -head battle one day with this. So tell me, with this cocktail, super classic, are there other versions of an old fashioned? Are there any like, uh, like I guess? I mean, the old fashioned is basically the prototypical recipe. Um, if you've seen our Sazerac episode, basically the same thing. You got spirit, you got sugar, and you've got bitters. Uh, a lot of recipes like that, not so many in fashion anymore. A lot of yeah. other, you know, people want lemon juice or citrus or, you know what I mean? I like something where I know that I'm having a drink, it's like a good steady sipper, you know what I mean? There's nothing nothing wrong with an all spirit drink, basically, you know what I mean? Do you have any good stories personally of, of old fashions? I mean, how many times do you go into like whatever bar? And if you're into cocktails and stuff, you go and order an old fashioned, how many times do you get somebody who gives you a whole piece of fruit salad yes. in there, mashes the cherry in it, oh. probably puts this upside down, shakes it, and then hands it to you real dirty. So I was so I, so, so I was telling this story off camera, and I'm gonna go ahead and just, just tell you guys, this probably won't even make the episode, but I'm gonna tell the story anyways. Bro, you don't know how to make a cocktail? Dirty pour on it. I was that guy. That's been a history of Mob Top, also drink history. Make sure y'all like, share, subscribe. We'll catch you guys next time.